need to grow the front line for policing in Gloucestershire because after a very, very substantial period of cuts and freezes, it's just not, we're not strong enough. Um, there is some money coming from the local taxation and also from national, we, we understand. But the police need to uh, regroup, they need to make sure that the front line is strong, that they're supported by the other agencies. For example, my view is the police have picked up huge amounts of work that should be being dealt with by the social services, by the, the health service, etc, etc. Because the police will always prioritise the risk to life. So we need to grow that. Uh, we need to train officers more because we need them to be fully equipped. Uh, the Barclay Training Centre, the Sabrina Centre will come online. So over the next four to five years, is, as we're told, austerity is being eased off. We need to grow the front line so we can get back to give a great service to the public. The every crime matters. We can get back into the areas where the police uh, sadly sort of lost the focus. It's just so important. It's a great opportunity now that the cuts appear to be over. We're going to grow the front line, look after the officers to keep them safe, maybe even less single crew than they are now, make sure our buildings, the equipment, our, all our tactics are there. We've got to grow the front line, quite frankly, because it's not strong enough at the moment. It's just not.